focus on your breath and think thoughts of goodwill. Goodwill is a wish for happiness, your own happiness and the happiness of others. The question is how you do those two at the same time, because there are so many pleasures we have in life that are going to inflict some pain on somebody someplace. A lot of times the pleasures they take might inflict some pain on us, too. The only happiness that you can wish without any kind of hypocrisy is well-being found inside. Because that kind of well-being doesn't need to take anything away from anyone else. It's something totally internal. And you've got all the resources you need inside. All you need is the effort to, to develop them and the mindfulness to keep from forgetting. This is why the Buddha put those qualities, mindfulness, alertness, ardency, all go together. Because those are the qualities that are needed to develop these potentials you have inside. So we wish goodwill to all beings, not only because we want them to be happy, but we also want to have a happiness that, so our happiness doesn't have to harm them and their happiness doesn't have to harm ours. That kind of well-being is hard to find, but this is why the Buddha pointed out the three main ways of finding genuine happiness is generosity, virtue, and meditation. Of the three, the meditation is the most important because it provides the foundation for the other two as well. And with generosity, there are times when you have to use material things, which sometimes you have enough of and other times you don't have enough of. With virtue, it's a little bit more unrestricted. You can, as the Buddha says, you can give a universal gift of safety to all beings by adhering to the precepts strictly. In other words, if you don't harm anybody at all, don't kill, steal from anyone, don't lie to anybody ever, then you get protected as well. That's a little bit more universal. Then finally with meditation, you can think thoughts of goodwill for everybody without exception, even people you don't like, even people you think whose behavior is repugnant. You can wish that they might come to their senses start developing their inner resources as well. So this is a safe and unhypocritical wish for happiness, a happiness that can go all around because nobody has to take anything from anywhere else. <laughs>